Thank you. Hi guys, so welcome back to another video. We are in JB today and this place is gonna eat some dim sum in crowd time because it's only oh, it's actually 9 a.m. in the morning. It's a little bit late already because they open at 7. We're supposed to eh, 7 to 1 p.m. We're supposed to come here earlier but we fell asleep and then the car ride from KSL uh KSL residence here is about 20 minutes. So we have reached arrive at what Gim Cheng Dim Sum restaurant um, to get your queue number we were a bit confused but there was a nice couple that tell us just take a table number then they will call for you so now this is we are 45 now four more tables see a big crowd there our first time here so let's see how this place goes and we'll show you is it worth the wait worth the hype worth the long queue yeah okay see you in the food where we are ordering food These are the steamy items and those are the fried items. Pao item, more pao. And their pao is ranging from 270 to 730 ringgit. All prices stated is in ringgit and the exchange rate right now is about 3.48 average fee. Yeah. 好 table but we are sharing Tiga orang So for this restaurant is something unique You can pick your own mystery dim sum because they don't list the items here I'm just kidding we have to go to the counter let's go So we have to order from here Oh yeah this yes, this Wow I want to the cabbage. Sir. Cabbage. Sir. cabbage sir. Uh, 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 the girl got to eat this or not? Yeah, she I'll take one more. I don't eat that. Wow, you have to be fast and furious here. <laughs> you want to uh, anything? I just take different thing. Uh. This is some more. Wow, very stressed. I don't know what this one. This one, one. I don't know what this is. 
Wow, it's really mystery. This is what? Ah, two on weekends and public holidays. I think it's mango prawn, but it's so beautiful, oh my god. And this is a fish cake. Fish cake, I think. Seafood. Seafood fish cake. Seafood cake. Seafood fish cake. <laughs> a bean cut roll with, I guess, prawns. And this, like, four tier with ginger. And lastly, we got a bowl of congee, like porridge. Century egg porridge, which I don't really eat. So, mommy and her will share. So, let's start <laughs> oh, this is nicer. The nicer one among the fried, the fried item. So I've tried like most of it except this one and this one. Steam beans the fried. Pork rib is amazing, like so fragrant, so tender. Juicy. I never tried the chicken feet, but they say it's very nice. Um, Hakao is is very it's actually very heavy. Then we're like okay, having high expectations of a lot of prawn. There is a lot of prawn, but I feel it's not very fresh the prawn. And then the skin is very thick. So that's one downside for this steamy dim sum. This one I haven't tried. Can I give it a try? It's like a seafood seafood ah. Okay, I'll give you a bite and give you see a cross section now. A lot of prawn. I think I ate a prawn shell. Huh? <laughs> nice, extra crunch. <laughs> but I think this is more young than the hakao. Yum yum. Okay, last one is the this thing. I'll just see how if I can eat it. Oh, pick it up. It's heavy. Ah, uh, my hand wants to cram. Okay, let's give it a bite. Oh, it was your friend. <laughs> According to mommy, um, there's century egg, so I don't eat century egg. But what's this, ah? Huh? Chicken, ah? Uh? Uh, chicken. Okay, I mean, not not what we eat, lah. Uh. Okay, let's continue eating and tell you when we are gonna do the overall review. Finish our meal here at this okay of dim sum place. Okay, see, we haven't finished quite a few items. Uh, I got too jelak with the dim sum, I don't know why. Usually I can eat quite a lot. But okay, just for overall review, I think there are some good items, but I would say not majority. Like, we didn't try everything, but based on what we ordered, I really like the pork rib. I really like this bean curd prawn thing. And I like um, just now that seafood steam thing. I have no idea what is it called. Uh, but like, I think the unique, one of the unique items is this the mango prawn which comes out on weekend. Not, I mean I ate two pieces already, but not uh, super fantastic lah. Just unique, unique texture, taste is okay. 
But okay, like over review wise, food I'll give it a six point five. Nothing really stand out. Uh, but okay, for ambience, this place is really like walking down memory lane for mummy lah. I don't know much about how this kind of old place, but like to her is very traditional. Like you can see the layout in the restaurant is very old school. They never really do anything to touch up the place, so it's quite it's quite cool lah. But just a little bit warm. The ambience is, I would give it a seven. Service wise, okay lah because. Everyone is rushing here and there, clearing up the table item, getting us to our seat, picking our orders. Service uh, also around 6, 6.5. Pricing, I'll give you an 8. Like, it's really cheap and worth for what we ordered here. Yeah, you can see. So how they pick your items is very smart. Like, why well, I don't I don't know how they go with it lah. But certain items, their starting prices are different. And then, if you order more items, they already added up. So the total number, let's say I bought, I bought 3 items of this pricing, they will add up for you. So later, we'll just go over to the counter and make our payment. I think, we don't know what's the total price, but I think based on this menu itself, even the most expensive item, I mean, it goes up. I mean, the most expensive item per item is 10 50 which convert to Singapore is about $3 plus. Very worth it. And you can see the cheapest one goes down to $2. 2 dollars 2.7 ringgit, which is about 90 cents, under 90 cents, which is amazing. So for pricing, give it an 8. And for overall review for restaurant game chain, okay, overall review first. I'll give this place a 6.5. Why come back again? I don't think I will necessarily come back, come down from KSL all the way here because the drive here is about 20 minutes. Not super fantastic. We'll try out more dim sum places. So yeah, that's my review for that. And lastly, this place has been open from 2008. So 15 years in business and you can see the crowd is still ever growing. And there is over 60 menu items in this restaurant. So yeah, amazing. Amazing variety, but quality a little bit more improvement. Thank you for watching this video. Do give us a like, subscribe, comment down below where other places in JB we should visit. See you, bye.